All right, guys. Welcome to episode 12. Starting off with a green dragon slayer task, so I'm just going to make a quick ring of wealth. So get a nice quick teleport out of there. And then we'll see what happens after that. I'm not too sure yet. This is a really good task. 91 jellies. I'll be able to go kill them in the catacombs. I think I can burst them, actually, as well. And it'll also be really good for hard clues. I got one of those from Green Dragons as well, so I'm going to go do that now before I start this jellies task. Next task, 74 blue dragons. I didn't end up getting any... Oh, no, sorry. I got one hard clue from the jellies, but I couldn't do it. Let's see how this one goes. This should be a nice uh, AFK task, actually. 80 range. 68 Slayer now, guys. Another task here. Not bad at all. 85 Blue Dragons. Blue Dragons task finished. 93 Jellies coming up next. I need to go switch to Ancients again so I can burst them. Just finished the task. Will we get anything from this? Oh, the hard clue right at the end. That's not bad. Okay, I'm going to have to cancel this one, unfortunately. Shades are absolutely terrible. This is my 100th task as well, I just realised that. Oh, there we go. Amazing. Right, let's go straight back. 79 magic, one level to go. And let's see what we get from the superior. Eight to one range. Very nice level here, 69 Slayer. I think I have all the requirements for Monkey Madness 2 now that I have this. Pretty sure I do. Yeah, I do. Okay, that is something that needs to be done. Maybe this episode as well, because I've got quite a few quests I need to do for this one. Also, these Santa hearts are pretty cool. Still on the Slayer grind. Just got 82 range as well. 68 combat, not bad. I'm not too far off 70 Slayer as well now. Just got 76 Agility. That's a pretty decent milestone, because now that gives me access to the shortcut near Zulra from when I eventually start that grind. 83 range coming in here. Not far off 69 combat now. As soon as I get 70, I'll be able to change Slayer Masters and hopefully improve the quality of my tasks. Just got 84 range and 69 combat. Very nice. Also approaching 72 Slayer as well. And there it is, 72 Slayer. I can kill Wyverns now, even though I probably am not going to have much use for those in the future since I can't use the Dragonfire Shield. Hey, here we go. 109 Kurasks, the first time ever. Let's see if we get lucky and get the Battle Axe. Holy shit, my very first kill I got a superior and did a combat achievement as well. This is probably one of my all-time favourite superiors as well. I think it looks so cool. Let's see if we get something lucky from it. Maybe this could be the start to a great task. See what we get. Ah, oh, that's not... Nothing, but... Oh, well. 2.7k Slayer XP for that one kill is crazy. That's so cool, man. Second superior, hopefully something good. I've just realised as well that I should be making bracelets of slaughter for this sort of task, so I'm going to get to work on making those for future tasks. See if we get anything. Oh, never mind. I'll take that seed though. Just got 85 range. I think this is going to be 70 combat as well now. There we go. I can finally use a better Slayer Master. I'm looking forward to seeing what tasks I get from that. Let's see if I get anything from this superior. I've just noticed 420 health on the King Kurask. Very nice. Hopefully we'll get something good. Oh, never mind. Maybe next time. Oh, man. I thought that was it there for a second. But it was a, a leaf-bladed sword instead. Damn. 
Just finished killing another superior. I forgot to set the record. I was reading the wiki, but um, I'm also 73 slaying out. Getting some nice levels today. Oh, I started recording because I thought I was about to get a level, but I'm so close to 80 farming here. Next time I come past this bush, it'll be uh, 80 farming. Okay, let's see what we get. See what we get for our first task ever. We've trailed it. Not bad. Could be worse. Here we go. Next time round. Oh, I need to get one more space. 80 farming. Nice. I've just got this hard clue from a Slayer task. I'm a few steps in, and I'm actually not able to complete this step yet because I haven't completed the Monkey Madness portion of Recipe for Disaster. So I'm going to take a break from Slayer and use this as a sign to get some quests done. I'm going to do the one that I've just mentioned, and then I'm also going to do the Path of Glufry because I'm curious about the new staff that you get from this quest or from the monsters after the quest. I'm not sure if it'll be better to use that. Um... For Zulra, I'm not sure. I, I, I kind of want to get my hands on it just to see. And um, we'll see what else I do after that. There we go. This took no time at all. 70 cooking. Yeah, first time. Nice. There we are. That is the final bit of recipe for disaster that I'm going to be able to complete. I am actually able to get access to rune gloves with this account build, but I'm not able to wear them unfortunately because I need to do the training after Monkey Madness 1 or I need to finish uh, Recipe for Disaster. But it's kind of cool to access them I suppose, just have them there. Oh wow, it's done already. That is such an easy quest for the reward that you get, wow. Four lamps as well. Oh right, okay. I'll take all that. 20k Slayer XP, that's amazing. 30,000 strength, I'll take that as well. Wow, that's such a good quest. Right, I need to look into the warp scepter now to see what's best to kill. Alright guys, it's a new day. Uh, I think I'm going to start today with getting a glory. So I'm going to do that by getting 76 crafting and then boosting with a mushroom pie. Just spent like 15 minutes getting this cap a mushroom pie and I don't even realize I have a mushroom pie right here oh well 76 crafting I'll just finish off these last few staves and then I'll go get the glory made oh I just reached 1600 total with that crafting level 2 I don't even notice and an amazing milestone here Finally getting access to the Amulet of Glory. Now the annoying thing about this is with my account build is that I'm actually not able in any way to charge these. Like, I can enchant them but I'm not actually able to charge them. Because for some reason there is a hero's, requi hero's quest requirement even for the Fountain of Rune. So my only way to get access to a charged glory is to get the trimmed version from hard caskets which is a pretty high drop rate I will be honest. So one of these days maybe they'll change that or maybe we'll get the trimmed glory we'll see. But until then I can only use it for its combat stats which is obviously fine but I'm not able to use the teleports. There we go. We have finally got it. Another reason that it's a little bit annoying that I'm not able to charge it is because when I'm mining, whether it's just doing standard mining or shooting stars, you get a much higher chance of uncut gems if you have a charge on your glory. So it's a little bit unfortunate because shooting stars are actually really enjoyable and the gems you do get from them with a charged glory is so much higher in comparison to uncharged ones but yeah it doesn't matter this is a first time task dust devils i would like to extend these eventually as well because these aren't a bad task for bursting i finally started doing some giant seaweed runs as well 
I, um, I've been looking into crafting and stuff, and it's just such an annoying skill to train on an Iron Man. So, I'm just gonna... Suffer th I'm just gonna suffer through these in the short term, and it'll be worth it later on. Pretty useless drop, but it's a log slot. Mystic Boots. Just doing a bit of AFK fishing at the moment. 70 fishing coming in. Thank you so much to this guy right here, Iron Hyper. Recognize me in game. This is the first time this has ever happened. So, a quick shout out to you. Thank you, man. Finally got it. Here we are. 75 Slayer. It's a great milestone. I can't wait for my first task of gargoyles. 81 Magic. Okie dokie, lots of demons done. If I get a shit task now, I'm going to switch up a bit and do some quests. It's the This is post Karend update, by the way, so I don't have to go and get favour for Love of Kendra and shit, which is why I waited. That will be really nice to uh, get those quests done and not have to do the favour anymore. I haven't fully read into the Karend update yet, but it seems really good. I can do this task right here, so I'm going to do it, and then we'll see what task I get afterwards. Fuck it. Right, see what we get. Ooh, my first Wyvern's task. I think, yeah, I, I think I'm going to do some quests for a little bit. I've got no idea if this is useful to anyone, but if you're ever on Ancient Spellbook and you want to get back to the standard one, you can do like a double swap with this guy, and you get back onto the ordinary one. Just in case there's someone who doesn't know. Alright boys, I'm just getting towards the end of an afternoon of AFKing at Kurasks. I've decided to kill them off task because I'm pretty desperate for a leaf bladed battle axe at this point. I've got a couple of ideas for future videos that basically I need a crush weapon for and I'm pretty sure the battle axe is going to be my best in slot for a long time. Um, but my total kill count is 797 Kurasks, so I'm still a couple of hundred kills away from being dry. But to be honest, I don't mind too much because these are really enjoyable to AFK. And as you can see, like the loot is really, really good. I came here with 100 nature runes and 10 ranging potions. And all the rest is what I've got as drops. So I can't really complain at all. Like They're really, really good. Um, I'm going to wait till this ranging potion expires. And then probably go do this clue. And then I might just come back here to be fair. Hopefully we'll get the battle axe soon though. It would be really nice to get it. I've also gained just under 200,000 XP in range. I'm 87 now, and then I'm also not far off 80 HP. The cash alone from this place is actually so good. I've more than doubled my cash pile now just from doing those. Amazing. 80 hit points now. Nice level. I'm still at Karasks. I've killed... I'm, I, I'm dry. technically dry now. I've killed 1,095 of them, but... I'm pretty set on not leaving until I get this battle axe. Still got plenty of ranging potions, hopefully we'll get it this invent. I do kind of need to go do this clue though, so we'll see what happens. Alright guys, 72 combat here, I got it from 88 range, 1625 total level as well. I actually can't wait to get to 75 combat, that's going to be so nice for Konar Slayer. I got it, I finally got it. How many kills? 1,617. Holy shit. Right, I can do something else. That looks so cool, man. I need to... My new AFK activity now is tr uh, training my attack and strength. Right, I think it's about time we started Song of the Elves, don't you? Let's go. This part is probably the bit that I'm dreading the most okay the one time that I've done this quest in the past I had access to stamina potions I do not have access to those yet on this account so this bit might take quite a while uh, let's go dodge that one pray back on with that one dodge that
I don't exactly know when I obtained these, but these Isleworth camp teleports have been amazing during this quest. Right, I need to keep an eye out for this range attack. I'm not... Is that it? I must be it there. Okay, that's actually not too bad. Or is it that one there? Oh, okay, when he should... Right, I get it, I get it. Oh, shit. Ah, there we go. You just gotta be quick on the protect from range. That's cool. I don't actually know if that's range or not. I don't think it is, is it? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Let's report up. Oh, I didn't get that in time. I might die there. Oh, I think I just got chanced. Lol, that's funny. I just need to stay on the spell book, to be honest. There we go, back to that, there we go. There we go, nice. Right, here we go guys. This is the setup. Not the best, but not the worst. I'm using Blood Blitz. Got plenty of runes, and then to kill the little healer things, I'm just going to throw iron knives at them. This is going to be mostly RNG based. It's basically just going to depend on how hard I'm able to hit. So, let's see. Let's go. Oh, that was slow. I don't think I've got this, unfortunately. Off! Ugh. Damn it. Let's go again. I don't think I had it that time anyway. Right, round two. Yeah, we are hitting way worse this time. This doesn't even compare to the first attempt. It doesn't compare at all. I'm just going to TP out of this one. I've hit like... God awful this one. Right, going to attempt number three now. Ah, this is so annoying, man. I'm so close every time. Alright, guys. It's the next day. I watched a video. I'm now researched. And I feel, I'm feeling good. I think we're going to get it this go. Let's go. Right, I need to take some damage here. Yes, I did it. Fuck, I don't even think I did it right there as well. Okay, it works. I'm, I should have brought a rock cake, I think, to take damage, but I think I should be okay. Now that I'm on low HP, I can just take one or two hits. This will keep me a nice, healthy amount of HP, I think. I need to pay more attention. I've still got four tries. I need to stay low HP, funnily enough. I never thought I would... Uh, Need that requirement against this boss, but here we are. Nice. Three goes left. Annoyingly, I think those double eats actually might have screwed me. We'll see though. Should be good. Oh, it's gonna be close. Those double eats actually screwed me, but at least I'll be able to do it guaranteed next time. Let's see if we get it. I might start hitting like a beast. I'll just give me 10 more of those, please. That's all I need. Thank you. 
Okay. Almost under 100. The healers, though. I need to hit good now so they doesn't heal back up too much. Come on. Rotation left after this. Come on. Let me see me actually. There we go. That was clean. Good hit afterwards as well. Oh, I think we've got this actually. Come on. I just need a few more good hits. There we go. Come on. Two or three good hits. There's one. Oops. Come on, I need to get him for the healers, man. Please. Ooh, that was a good hit. One more good hit. Yes, we've done it, boys. Easy game. That was a great method. It's finally done. Here we go, boys. Tremendous achievement for the account. Look at that XP drop. Not a single level, nice. Oh, it feels good to have that quest done. This unlocks so much content now. So much new content that I'm going to be absolutely brand new to. Alright guys, coming towards the end of the episode now. Don't go anywhere though because I've got caskets to open. But here's a very quick look at the stats. I haven't updated in a while so I thought after seeing as we've just completed this quest, I may as well show them as well. And then, with all the Slayer that we did this episode, I've got... A very nice amount of caskets. I've actually got more hard caskets than anything else. So let's open the easy ones first. I'm just going to try and speed through them. I don't want to be commenting, uh, commentating too much on them. Right, here goes. Easy first. Ooh, nice little fashion escape to start off with. That's actually really nice. Is that a unique? No, it's not. Gothic's robe legs, not bad. I've got the top for those, I think. And then elegant skirt, don't really care about that. I need to put the Klein in f uh, the resizable too. Okay, that's the easiest. Right, I'm pretty sure now if I open a casket and I get a pop-up, it, it won't get in the way. Right, 10 mediums, this could be big. Come on, let's go. Okay. That's the first five. The next five. Orange butter, nice. Brown headband. Two more to go. Unicorn mask, not bad. Last one. Ah, damn it. Never mind. No boots this time. Right on to the hard ones. Here we go. Okay, so the only thing really that I want from these, ideally, would be a trimmed uh, glory, because then I could have access to a charged one, or some goddy eyed chaps. So let's go, boys. Okay, just a bunch of archibalds so far. The next five. Oh my god, I actually got it. Wow! The only way we can get access to a, the a charged glory on this account is via hard clues, and we've actually done it. Wow. Mate, that that is going to make mining so much 
more efficient for gems. Holy shit, I cannot believe I actually just got that. Wow, that's amazing. I need to make sure I don't accidentally teleport with this thing. Yeah, there's a remove option. Oh, that's amazing. God DI chaps now. That would be a great ending. What's that? Guffix Crozier, okay. Right, let's get the. Oh, that was worth 69k. Right, let's get the last. Is it five? Six out. Let's go. Okay, here we go. The final six. 21 sweets. Uh, nothing good there. I'm not able to use these, I don't think. Red Dragon Mask will take it. The Fashion Scape. Two more to go. I'll take the Zami page. That's, that's new. Last one, guys. Here we go. Ah, oh, I can't wear it. That's cool, though. It's a unique. Those are some good openings. Holy shit. Alright, thank you very much for watching, guys. This has been a very fun episode to make.